Superintendent Coates. Judge, have you ever discussed Special Counsel Mueller or his investigation with anyone? Well, it's uh, in the news every day. I, have you discussed it with anyone? Uh, with other judges, I know. Uh, have you discussed Mueller or his investigation with anyone at Kasowitz, Benson, and Torres, the law firm founded by Mark Kasowitz, President Trump's personal lawyer? Uh, Be sure about your answer, sir. Um, well, I'm not remembering, but if you have something you want to... Are you certain you've not had a conversation with I, anyone at that law firm? Kasowitz, Benson... Kasowitz, Benson, and yeah. Torres, which is the law firm founded by Mark Kasowitz, yeah. who is President Trump's personal lawyer. Are you, have you had any conversation about Robert Mueller or his investigation with anyone at that firm? Yes or no? Well, is there a person you're talking about? I'm asking you a very direct question, yes or no. I, I need to know the... I'm not sure I know everyone who works at that law firm. I don't think you need to. I think you need to know who you talked with. Who'd you talk to? I don't think I, I I'm not remembering, but I'm, I'm happy to be refreshed or if you want to tell me who you're thinking so are who you, works. I, are you saying that with all that you remember, you have an impeccable memory. You've been speaking for almost eight hours, I think more, with this committee about all sorts of things you remember. Yeah. How can you not remember whether or not you had a conversation about Robert Mueller or his investigation with anyone at that law firm. This I don't, investigation has only been going on for so long, sir. So right, please I'm not sure I, do I, I, I'm just trying to think, do I know anyone who works at that firm? I might know. Have you had, that's not my question. My question is, have you had a conversation with anyone at that firm about that investigation? It's a really specific question. I would like to know the person you're thinking of, because what if there's I think a, you're thinking of someone and you don't want to tell us. Who did you have a conversation with? I, I am. I'm not. Mr. Over. Chairman, I, I, I'd like to raise an objection here. Um, this town is really full of law firms. Us. Law firms are full of people. First of all, I'd like you Hold to pa on. pause the clock. He Thank you. The clock is paused. Thank you. Pause the clock. Let me raise the my objection. Recognized. This town is full of law firms. Law firms are full of people. Law firms mm -hmm. have a lot of names. There are a lot of people who work at a lot of law firms. <laughs> And be a hero and vote no. Be a hero and vote no. You have the responsibility to all Americans. Be a hero and vote no. Be a hero. Senator Lee, I, on that point, um, <clears throat> law firms abound in this town, and there are a lot of them. They're constantly metastasizing. They break off. They form new firms. They're like uh, rabbits. They spawn new firms. There is no possible way we can expect this witness to know who populates uh, a, an entire firm that he's My point of order, Mr. Chairman, is simply this. If, if, if there are names, if there is a list of names he can be given of the lawyers to whom she, uh, uh, she's referring, I think that's fine, but I think it's unfair to suggest that a, an entire law firm should be imputed into the witness's memory when he doesn't know who works at the law firm. Mr. Chairman, Mr. Chairman, Senator Whitehouse, we have Are you making a, a point of order? Well, Senator Whitehouse, I'm the, trying uh, to figure out what the rules are here because we had a very, very long discussion about whether or not points of order were in order because this is a hearing. And we were told that all of our points of order Senator Whitehouse, all there, the documents. There, there's never been a, a, a time in the, in the two days where someone's made an inquiry of the chair where the chair hasn't recognized the member for a point of inquiry or a point of order. And I've been recognized now, and I appreciate that. But my point is that if the rule is that nobody on our side can make a point of order, then it ought not to be appropriate for Senator Lee to start making points of order the, after all of ours were summarily 
Senator Biden. Silenced White. on the basis that we were in a hearing and not in an executive session. If we've moved out of hearing and into executive session, then I'm more than happy to make motions. Senator to Whitehouse, the if uh, the mere fact that you're speaking right now means that you've been allowed to make a point of order, the matter that you're talking about yesterday was a motion that the chair said was out of order because it was, it was an adjournment motion that would have required us to be in executive session. Mm -hmm. Anyone who makes to make it want to make an inquiry, the chair may do so, uh, but we will limit it to that before we go back to Senator Harris. Very good. That's the right result. Sir, please answer the question. I don't know everyone who works at that law firm, Senator. And have you had any discussion with anyone ever about Bob Mueller and or his investigation? So you said Bob Mueller or, so have or I ever had a discussion about Bob Mueller? I used to work in the administration with Bob Mueller. What about his investigation? Have you had a conversation with anyone about his investigation? I'm sure I've talk to fellow judges. Anyone aside from fellow judges? About Bob Mueller? About his investigation, sir. I'll ask again. But so I asked the question just a minute ago. I'm surprised you forgot. Have you had this conversation with anyone about the investigation that Bob Mueller is conducting regarding Russia interference with our election or any other matter? The fact that it's ongoing, it's a topic in the news every day um, I talk to uh, it's uh, talk to fellow judges about it it's in our you know it's in the courthouse in uh, the District of Columbia so and I guess uh, and I'll ask the answer to that is time. yes so the answer is yes okay and did you talk with anyone at Kasowitz Benson and Torres you, you asked me that I need to know who works there I think you can answer the question without me giving you a list of all employees of that law firm well, actually, I can't. I, Why not? Because I don't know who works there. So that's the only way you would know who you spoke with? I, I want to understand your, your, your response to my question, because it's a very direct one. Did you speak with anyone at that law firm about the Mueller investigation? It's a very direct question. Right. I'd be, I'd be surprised, but I don't know anyone. I don't know if the... I don't know everyone who works at that law firm, so I just want to be careful, because your question was and or... So I want to be very literal. That's, that's fine. I'll ask a more direct question if that's helpful to you. Did you speak with anyone at that law firm about Bob, Bob Mueller's investigation? I'm not remembering anything like that, but I want to know a roster of people, and I want to know more. So you're not denying that you spoke with well, them? Well, I, I said I don't remember anything like that. Okay. I'll move on.